When Kathy Robinson talks at church meetings and support groups, she speaks from experience. The FDIC came in and closed down Freedom Bank. That's where I worked as the Human Resources Director. That particular weekend was also the weekend I was celebrating my 50th birthday. So I had a pity party, no celebrating happened, and it was a very, very stressful time when the FDIC comes in. Two weeks later, I found out I had a brain tumor. She'll never forget getting the bad news. I couldn't even see. I was starting to cry that hard. It was just the darn shock of it. Uh, Hearing you have a brain, you have something growing in your head. It's got to come out. Uh -huh. It was just, it was total shock. Robinson quickly rallied, though. Her tumor was removed December 30th, and she started a new life in the new year. Now she's writing a book and sharing her experience. People need a, a message of hope. They need to hear a message of hope today. And I've got... I had some hopeless times, I had some real tough hopeless times, but you just draw from what's in here and you use your faith. At First Baptist Church in Sarasota, Robinson encourages people to make the best of their situations. It is what it is. How many times have I heard people say that in the last six months? That should be like on bumper stickers. <laughs> it is what it is. Okay, so it is what it is. I'm just going to accept it and move on from it. Losing a job doesn't have to be the end of the world. Come up with 10 things you're grateful for, because we, we're so quick to complain. We're so quick to do that, and we need to practice being quicker to praise and being thankful. As part of her new life, Robinson is happy to practice what she preaches. At HeraldTribune.com, this is Tom Becknell.